So Brighton beat Middlesbrough, if you guys can remember, on the channel in the third round of the FA Cup. But today is the big day for the Liverpool game once again. Only two weeks ago, we were here beating Liverpool 3-0. Can it happen again? We'll have to see. Today is the fourth round of the FA Cup. Another matchup here at the Amex Stadium with a very weird kickoff, a 1.30 p.m. here in the south of England. Today, my score predictions is going to be a little more interesting. Considering what's happening with Moises Caicedo at the moment, I'm going to go with a one-all draw here today. I was going to go for a 2-1, a very positive but today, no, we're going with a draw today. It will go into a replay against Liverpool in the Anfield. Let's see if the Albion can prove me wrong today and we can beat Liverpool twice in a row at the Amex Stadium. This is your boy, Luke Links Brighton, and welcome back to another Luke Links Brighton match day vlog. I'm so humble, don't play around. This is your time, don't mess around, boy. <laughs> Me telling you who I think should be in each position. So, if you guys want to hear my opinions on what's happening with Moises Caicedo, I made a video yesterday about all the drama with Moises and my opinions on it. But today, it's not going to be any Moises Caicedo because the Brighton and Hove Albion have told him to take some time away from the club. So today, we could be seeing Billy Gilmore, possibly. Okay, so we're here with Charlie. Charlie, shout out your YouTube channel because you have a YouTube channel. What is your YouTube channel so people can go subscribe? Are you sure? Yeah, go for it, man. Uh, Charlie Football. Charlie Football. Go subscribe to him. He does match day vlogs for Brighton as well. Charlie, today's a big one. We have beaten Liverpool two weeks ago, 3 0. Can it happen again? Can we do it again? What's going to happen? What's just goal scorers and score predictions for today? Yeah, so I'm not going to go 3 0. I okay. think uh, they'll be wanting a bit of revenge. Yep. Uh, I think it's going to be one off for quite a bit. Yes. Uh, Ferguson with the first goal. Okay, love that. Then I think eventually Matoma might get a uh, goal later. Uh, go on. It's going to be 2 1 Brighton. 2 1 Brighton. We absolutely love that. So obviously, we're having a lot of. Um, it's a lot going on with Moises Caicedo. What are your thoughts on that? And do you think that it's good that he he's staying at the moment? Do you think he should have been uh, given the opportunity to leave for that 60 mil or whatever it was, 55 mil? Yeah, I think Tony Bloom's done a good job standing his ground. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so I think he should stay till the yeah. summer. Yeah. And maybe we should uh, let him go then. Yeah. Maybe we can find a potential replacement. I think we're looking at one right now. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, I think not good situation. I think it's his agent. It's not. It's not, no. is it, at all? No, absolutely not. Do you think he's going to damage us today? Because apparently he's not going to be playing today. Do you think it's going to damage us? No, no, I think we'll cope all right. I okay. mean, we saw how Trossard left. That didn't affect us. Yeah. I think we'll have enough. Yeah. Uh, enough. yeah. Okay, love it. Charlie, appreciate you coming on, mate. No. Okay, we're here with, again, we saw this guy in Middlesbrough. What is your score predictions, guys, both of you, for today's match? Uh, I'll say 2 0, I guess. Uh, I'm hoping like we'll get a Sully Marsh scored again. Mm. And, and Evan Ferguson, you know, yeah. he's really exciting, yeah. So, yeah. What do you think today about score predictions? Can I say draw? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, 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 I guess. Goal I scores? Guess. Yeah, draw. Uh, Goal scores as well? Yeah, yeah, mm, yeah, maybe 0 0. Okay. I, 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 so, I guess. So I guess. No one score. Okay. No. Okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Interesting. Interesting. So, what do you think? Obviously, about Moises Caicedo. Do you think that it's uh, good that Brighton have standed their ground and and kept him in the squad, or do you think that he should have been let go? I think that Klopp did the right thing to let him not to go to training. You know, yeah. like, like they get on top of the situation yeah. instead of like we did in uh, we we had Kukurea, we had. Uh, 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 Trossard, you know, left like like yeah. they, they really want to go and we have to let them go. But yes. now we are on top of the situation. I think the club did the right thing and um, no one's bigger than the club. No. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, Exactly. The, my, my point as well. I, I completely agree with you guys, but I appreciate you guys for coming on for this interview. Thank you very much. Thank you. Okay, so we are joined by Oscar. Oscar, today is a big match. Now, we beat Liverpool two weeks ago, 3-0. What's going to happen today? What's your goal scorers and predictions? I think 2-1 Brighton, I think McAllister, okay. and I'm not sure on the other one. All right, yeah. Um, Possibly maybe, Ferguson, yeah, maybe. Ferg if, if he starts, yep. Ferguson. For Liverpool, Cody Gakpo. 
Oh, Gapo, yeah, yeah, interesting one. Okay, so obviously there's a lot going on with Moises Caicedo, and uh, I've heard that he's not going to be playing in this match. Who do you think is going to replace him in that role for today? Do you think it's going to be Billy Gilmore, Samiento, and Ciso? I think Billy Gilmore probably mm -hmm. is the most yeah. sort of reliable option to go in that role. Yeah, um, yeah I think Gilmore. I don't think... Um, I was thinking Buonanotte. Yeah, but he's got an injury, unfortunately. Oh, right, I've heard, right, I've yeah, heard, yeah. Right. Um, but Moises Caicedo at the moment, do you think that it's good that Brighton have obviously kept him here at the club, or do you think they should have let him go when he wanted to? I think um, he's sort of in a different position to Trossard. Trossard was kind of bringing the team morale down. Caicedo's more kind of asked to leave. Yes, so agreed. I think it's better we keep him for yes. now because he could always change his mind it's not like he's obviously i've seen he's not turning up to training yeah but he's not kind of got any bad blood with the club no. at the moment no. so, so I it's think not really a rush for him to leave yeah, is it yeah exactly i don't think i think he's a different situation yeah, to Trossard. I, agree. I do agree yeah yeah I totally agree oscar yeah. thank you for coming thank on man you. i appreciate thank it you. Thank yeah you. All right, we're here again with Ben and Joe. Guys, today's a big match. What's happening? What's your score predictions? Uh, I'm going to go 2-1. 2-1. Goal scorers? Uh, I think Matoma and Evan Ferguson. Ooh. What do you think? Predictions, goal scorers? I think they're going to put quite a good fight up. Maybe like 3 or 2-1. Really? OK, 3-2-1. Yeah. What do you think goal scorers? Um, maybe like Gross, Ferguson, Matoma. Oh, absolutely love that, guys. Thank you for coming on. Appreciate it. Boom, boom. Nice. Okay, we're here with Brian. Brian, today, score predictions for today and goal scorers. What is happening? Well, I don't think it's going to be like the last match. I think it's going to be a lot tougher. They're the cup holders. Yes. So they're going to be fighting. Yeah. But yep. guess what? We're going to win. We're going to win. My prediction is 2-1 to Seagulls. Love that. What's your score predictions? Um, I think it could well... Well, I'd like Ferguson to score mm -hmm. yep. and Matoma. Yes, we course. love that. What do you think about the situa situation with Moises Caicedo at the moment? And do you think that it's good what Brighton have done to keep him? Or do you think they should have let him go? I think, um, in all honesty, it's mm. probably better for him to stay till the end of the season, is, all yeah. round. Um, but I can understand he's got a new agent and that agent's putting him under pressure, pressure yeah. because he wants a cut. Yeah. And, you know, a cut out of 100 million is a absolutely. lot. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. We should have a share of it. No, definitely, <laughs> definitely. Uh, appreciate you coming on, Brian. No, I really do appreciate Cheers. you coming on. Thank nice you. Nice meeting you. Yeah, Liz. and you, man. Thank Bye. you. I said one all, but I'll tell you what. The lineup that I'm seeing here today is incredible. Literally incredible. Matoma, Welbeck, Ferguson, March, McAllister, Gross. We've got Stealing Goal, which is a little different. We've got Webster back as well today. It's going to be an interesting one. We are looking like we're going all out attack today. So let's see what we can do. Turn back to the Albion. Yeah, good. Oh, that's close. Oh God. Oh God. Good save. Oh, I'm real. I think that was Webster there. Incredible defending. Oh. Sully. Oh, Wilbeck! To Evan! No! Oh, Evan Ferguson! A tapping was there! Oh, I can't believe it! Good! Two! No! No! Salah misses! Salah misses an absolute. Well, I would not say sitter, but God, you don't see Salah miss from there very often. Sorts of problems going on over there. 
Liverpool fans going for it. God, Liverpool fans are even over there. Oh my lord. They really do have a lot of fans here today. Most I've ever seen in the Amex. Liverpool so it stands for 1-0 up. Don't know who it was, Harvey Elliott? I think Harvey Elliott. Ooh, going short. Interesting. Shoot! Yes! Yeah! Oh my god! Terry Glancy! Oh my lord! What a shot! What a goal! Unbelievable! Incredible first half. Incredible first half. And I tell you what, Liverpool fans, never seen so many away fans in my life in this stadium. But here it is at the end. One Brighton, one Liverpool. Let's go on to that second half. Let's see if Brighton can get it to 2 1. Second half started. Webster has been replaced by Zhao Veltman. So that's interesting to see. We'll see, uh, I don't know why. Maybe maybe he's a little injured or something. I must be. Lewis Dunk. Oh my god, he did! Oh! Darwin will substitute. Henderson. Thiago. Thiago again. Robertson. And it's Keepers. Nice. can't believe it but I think we're seeing Evan Ferguson could be coming off here I can't believe it Fabinho's just injured Evan Ferguson our star boy up front oh my god can this month get any worse can this month get any worse with players going injured I can't believe it I can't believe it it's good actually Oh, it's Omar! It's Omar! Challenge. 
changes that Liverpool have done. They've injured our Evan Ferguson. Brighton beating Liverpool twice in a row, that Alex. Hey! Come on! Come on! I can't believe it. I can't believe we've just beat Liverpool again. 2-1. Against Liverpool again at the Amex Stadium. I cannot believe it. And it's Karu Matoma, ladies and gents. Karu Matoma. We love it. We absolutely love it. Karu Matoma. Come on, boys! I can't believe it. What's a North Stand around? We're joined by Morad and Amir. Guys, today, what a win. Liverpool beating them 2-1 again. What's your thoughts after the game today? Really great game. Uh, well played to Brighton. What yeah. a goal from Matoma as well. Oh, wow. Yeah. Man of the match? Uh, probably, yeah. It has to be, yeah. Matoma? Yeah, yeah. yeah. What about you? Yeah, great performance. They played really well, so yeah. we really enjoyed the game. Ah, so really? hopefully we're going to see Brighton on top level. Come on, Brighton! Yeah, I love it. I <laughs> love it. So, so uh, hopefully we're going to see Bryson all the time, all the time on top of the Premier League. Yeah. So uh, we're happy. Uh, so uh, yeah, great game, that. great performance. Man of the match? Man of the match, Tom. Yeah. Love that. Do you think we'll we'll possibly have a chance on winning the FA Cup? Probably. Uh, why not? Why not? Yeah. yeah why not? They played well. If they, yeah. they, you know, they played the way they are doing yeah. now. So I'm sure we're gonna, you know, why not win it? Ah, uh, brilliant, guys. I appreciate Thank you both coming much, on. Thank, Thank you. you. Okay, we're here with Jack. Jack, what a performance today. <laughs> We've just beaten Liverpool once again. Incredible. Your thoughts? Mate, amazing, incredible. Such good play, passing, two touch play, amazing. We beat the press, like pressed us for like 30 minutes. It was incredible. The composure from Motoma's goal. Oh my God. No other Premier League player could do yeah. that in that sort of situation but incredible. How crucial is Karu Matoma for Brighton over Albion? So crucial. More, I say more crucial than Caicedo. Yeah. Incredible. Man of the match? I want to go Matoma, you know. Yeah. That's Brilliant. Good. Jack, appreciate you, bro. You're welcome. Okay, so we're here with Finley. Finley, first of all, what's your channel's name? You have a YouTube channel. Let us all know what your YouTube channel name is. Finley Forsyth Autistic Hero. Go and subscribe to him. Finley, what do you think about the game today? Big win against Liverpool, isn't it? Yeah. What do you think? It's really good. Really good. Do you think that we can go further in the FA Cup? I think we will. Like, to the final we could. Yeah. Maybe. Do you think we could possibly win it? I think we could, actually. Yeah? Yeah. Who do you think is your man of the match for today? Matoma. Matoma. Wow. Finley, I appreciate you coming on, buddy. Thank you. No worries. Okay, we're with a couple of Japanese Matoma fans. Guys, what do you think about Matoma's winning goal today? Um, that was like very first time I see Matoma in person and, wow. and the actual football game in person yeah. and that was incredible. Yeah. What do you think? Yeah. That was amazing. He's so calm yeah. in the goal, in yeah. front of the goal. Yeah, and he created a, a lot of chances yeah. Yeah. Uh, against uh, Arnold yeah. and again, even against uh, Milner. Yeah. yeah. He's incredible, in incredible. Yeah, he was yeah. really like considerable, I would say. Yeah, yeah. really composed. But I yeah. Talk about the, um, yeah, I was concerned about uh, Caicedo. He was missing today. He was missing today. Yeah, and the call wheel. Yes. Yeah, yes. I think yeah for me, I think he's a yeah. good player. Yeah. We really needed uh, Matoma to step up today, and he did, didn't he? And he scored again. He's really crucial for us. So, how good is the Amex Stadium? And do you recommend other Japanese fans to come and watch Matoma at the Amex? Yes, definitely. Yeah, like definitely. for sure, yeah. honestly. Yeah. Definitely. That was incredible. definitely. Yeah. yeah. Appreciate it, guys. Thank you for coming on. Yeah. Thank you very much. Thanks, thank you. Oh crikey boys, we always get you on at the end and uh, look, I reckon you will be the last interview again. <sighs> it's actually, it got emotional. It actually got a little bit emotional. I, I felt for Liverpool, they were really dirty coming to the end. They, you know, they tackled Ferguson. They've been all over McAllister all game. I, I felt this one really, you know, felt good, this win against Liverpool oh, today. Yeah, so Almost good. as good as the 3-0. I, I don't know why, but it just did. Force on it, Nev, come on. Karen Matoma. Hey, oh, it was so good. And do you know what? Um, just when you thought it was going to a replay at Anfield, he comes in, and I, I'm going to watch that back. I don't know how he got through that crowded area, brought it over a defender, and such a composed, composed finish. Yeah. And 
we're in the last 16, you know. We can dare to dream, boys. We can dare to dream. How important is Karu Matoma? He is so important. It, I, I mean, honestly, and I was saying to Christian, if he wasn't on that pitch, no, I don't even think we'd have a goal in us because he just no. he just creates. And you, can, you yeah. know, he's he, him and Trent, they've had that battle for the last few weeks. He makes it look easy. He, may, he makes look, Trent look average. Yeah. He did today again. Yeah. Yeah. He is, he's unbelievable. Christian, what do you think about today? Absolutely crazy, isn't it? Yeah, honestly, I can't believe, you know, lightning has, lightning has struck twice at the Amex. Yeah. Like, I can't believe it. Like, yeah. what a win. Absolutely like, crazy. And like you said, it feels much better as well. 2-1, quite a tight game. Mm -hmm. I didn't think we win today, but like, yeah, it's good we did it here. I yeah. think if we'd gone to Anfield, we wouldn't have won, so it's good we did it here, I think. We've already broken a record of beating Liverpool for the very first time at the Amex. We've just done it twice in a row. Man of the match today. I mean, I think I would say, I think I'd say Matoma again, just because yeah. of that goal he got. Like, yeah. amazing. Go on, Niv. Do you know what? I want to say Matoma, but they gave it. I really enjoyed Ferguson again today. Yeah. I actually enjoyed Ferguson's performance. I'm on par with them too. But with Matoma with that late goal, it'd be rude if I didn't give it yeah. to him. Wouldn't it? It'd be rude. Absolutely. It'd be rude. Absolutely. Absolutely. We're looking for a bit of luck then for who we get next as well, obviously. Yeah. There are a few easy teams, so not many left. Let's hope we get one of those easier teams. Boys, big up for coming on again. And what another Toma. win. Matoma. Come on. <laughs> oh my goodness ladies and gentlemen it got a bit emotional like i i know it's the only fourth round of the fa cup but it felt so deserved and there's been a lot happening recently in the club you know with moises with trossard leaving now we have ferguson that's injured i felt like we're losing our players we've got cole out we've got lalana out now as well there's so many players that are gone we're sort of low on players right now and it's quite worrying but we have clawed a massive, huge win today and we're through the next round in the FA Cup. I'm absolutely buzzing for it. Brighton surprised me today. I said 1-0. It nearly was 1-0. My prediction was very nearly right, but we got away with it. We got the winning goal by the main man, Karu Mitoma. Absolute Japanese star and let me tell you, I love him to bits. He is one of my, probably the favourite player now, in my opinion, in Brighton Hove Albion. I want to say a massive thank you to everybody that is watching this match day vlog and has watched the whole of it. If you have never seen my face before and this is the first video you've ever seen, please go ahead and subscribe. Click that subscribe button, turn that bell notification on because you'll be notified every time I make a new video and it's completely for free. Guys, I am looking to get a whopping 1.2 thousand likes on this video. If you could go ahead and press that like button, it would mean the absolute world. Without further ado then, ladies and gentlemen, it's been your boy, Luke Links Brighton, and I'll see you, Brighton fanatics, in the next one. Off I go. Oh,